Sharice Henry lives in the glow of her iPhone screen. So giving it up was a nail biting moment. There'd be no more Facebook, no more Instagram, no more messaging. Are you prepared to do this? I'm prepared. All right. Well, her heart rate went up quite a bit. A nurse monitored her vital signs as she handed the device over and her blood pressure went up. 129 over 88. It go up a little bit. Her heart rate jumped. When I first took it, it was 88, and now it's 103. She felt uncomfortable. My, you know, heart racing, anxious, thinking like, what am I gonna do without my phone for a few days? Dr. Robert Morrow of Pocono Health System said those are typical withdrawal symptoms. It can uh, alert people to the fact that there really is a problem here and that we do need to take it seriously. Cherie struggled on day one, but the second smartphone free day was easier for her. I honestly realized like after day one and that hurdle of anxiety was over, how stupid the addiction is as a whole and made me want to not have that phone with me at all and just have a normal means of communicating with someone. She found she had more time on her hands for things like chores. I was much more productive around my house. <laughs> but would that last? Did the two day digital detox work? Here's your phone. Thanks. Um, I'm a little anxious to power it on, see who's text me or called me. She powered the phone back up right away. I have 16 text messages and 46 emails. But Sharice insists she learned she doesn't need to check it so often. I do think I could spend less time on it, for sure. I think it did help her. I think she did understand that, uh, you know, it takes away from a lot of time. Sharice now believes her smartphone is enabling her habit, so she may get rid of it. I know myself well enough to know that that might be a challenge for me, so downgrading may be my best option. Dr. Morrow said realizing there is a problem is the first step to making a change. I would say to Sharice, if you're having a hard time managing this on your own, reach out for help and support. Support from friends, support from family, and a few days of digital detox could help you silence your cell and focus on what really matters. In Monroe County, Laurie Monteforti, Eyewitness News.